All right, I see we're moving toward the construction of like a computer since we got logic gates last time and now we're going to get virtual processing, which is something I'm not even going to pretend to know what it is, but I'm, this shape doesn't look too hard. So I'm thinking we could probably just build it like right here instead of having to find that one shape and pump everything over. The only thing I'm worried about is running out of space. And even if we do, like I could get rid of this thing, I think, right? It just makes that shape. I don't like want to, but I could Let's see which one do we want here? Probably this. So I think I'm okay because we have a lot of squares and circles here and that's all we need to build that shape. So I'm going to try and get that started. I'm thinking, let me see if I can get something compact going first. So if I take a four-way cutter twice. And do something like this. Let's see what we got here. All right, so there's no like clean and easy way to do this, I don't think. Probably what's best is rotating that and this and then just doing this. All right, that'll give us Oh, come on, man. I don't... Okay, so that's one of them. But we can use the other stuff. I'm going to put that there for now so it'll keep spitting out the right shapes. So, like... If we rotate this one this way and... this one this way that'll give us something right and then this is kind of silly but maybe if we do like this that gives us one of both Oh, you know what? Let's, I can compact this a little bit. If I, let's see, if I do this and I swap those so that I think, and then just one rotation for this one. I think that's good enough because eventually this should swap over to the side oh we are connected all nope hold on uh nope i did this one's working just fine but the other one's not There we go. All right, perfect. Again, not the prettiest thing, but that does give us enough if we copy and paste this over. So that's three, so six, eight, ten, and just for safety, I'm gonna do 12. I don't think we need to. Oh, whoops. Uh, that's probably fine, I mean, yeah, why not? I mean, I don't really need all this anyway. If we do, we can find a way to get it put it back together. It's not too hard. Alright, so I just need something like this. 
for that, and then this because we can do that and then have this come through and then out that that should work oh this gotta go over like this and then over there there I'm trying to make it more copyable Again, not the prettiest thing, but it does kind of do our job for us. There. Alright, so that's one thing. Now, that needs to be dyed white, which we can get taken care of pretty easily. Uh, I'm thinking, because that's just green. Here, let's do this part first. So what we really need here, which is super easy to get done, is just a square that we cut apart and we just stick parts of it back together. So like if I rotate this one this way and this one this way and stack them both up, that's like two different, right, the two different ones. So, we just need one, or we're going to die everything anyway. Alright, so we need a lot of those. Or we do it both ways. Like we just... Hmm. Yeah, I'm thinking we can do it, because this is the bottom part. So, if we do that, come on, man. Alright, now they're both going the same direction. We only need this six times. So, let's do one of those. Um... So, three, four, five. Wait, that's five, six. Then we can paint these. Oh, uh, but they're too close together, I think. Are they, oh, wait, are they? Yeah, they are. We need them to be like right here. So, this can come like so, because we need that to go like that, so this can come straight across, but we need them to be one more up, like so, I think, yeah, that sounds right, and then, oops, come on. There, I think that should work. And four, five, six, so this one will come up like so. Maybe. Oh, I forgot. Hold on. That's probably part of it. Yep, I'm sure that didn't help. There we go. And then if I think I'm I think I'm right here by saying that should work and then a full set of conveyor belt or extractors here. One full conveyor belt is what I mean to say. 
should be able to just go through and be enough. All right, so that's the first part. Now, if we get right, that goes on the bottom. Okay, on the bottom. So what we want is, I think, like this, because we can have the the white shape coming from the side, like so. Oh wait, uh, here, and come in and up, and this. Right, and I did leave one gap for the other part of it. I think that's that's right, also. So we can just copy it around. Oop. Missed that one up, my bad. Four, three, four, five, six. Oh, so we didn't dine them yet. Oh, whoops. Uh, my bad. I can't do that yet. Um. Hmm. Oh, I might have messed that up. That's a uh, oopsie. We got oops. There's no convenient greens where we built these either. So, all right. Here's what we're going to do. I'm going to take this whole thing. We're going to move it. down here how big is this oh it's huge because there's red blue green here can it fit no it takes up a whole screen wow All right, I might have made a big mistake um hmm Nope, I think I'm going to put it back. I'm going to put it back. And we're going to take this whole thing and copy it like we usually do. And put it right above this. We're gonna put it like right here. And just pop in the colors different ways. Yep, that's what we're gonna have to do. That's fine, that's fine. We're still making great time today. So that'll be blue and then let's get this all set up. Those go up and over into right here. Just need a red and green, which we can bring up from the bottom here. Yeah, that's that's pretty easy actually. Oh, so we going upgrade, nice. It's the sound I like to hear. Oh, you know what? Those might be. I'm not gonna move these over. A little bit. Yeah, I think I need one of them to go here and one to go here so that this can go here and there. So green comes into that and then up. And we will have a red do the other way. 
I feel like I'm making this a little more complicated than it really needs to be. But, you know, if I didn't do that every single time we did something, what would be the point of doing anything? Uh, mixed in paint. How about that? All right, now we got those, and we can bring them down into the right side of this. So this needs to be the other way. Yep, just bring it straight on down. Okay, that's step one and two. And now I think I messed up a little bit. I'm going to need to bring that over to this way because I need those squares that I'm covering up right there there because the goal now is to basically copy this or hold on well I need to copy this place it yeah that's right or I could just place it over here yeah I'm gonna do it the other way so basically here but I need to swap those so let me get the squares coming in just so I know which way I'm doing things Just gonna rebuild it. Uh, okay, so the first ones. So we need it to face the left side. So that means. Like so and like so. Perfect. Okay. Now, if we put one of these like this. We should be able to, I'm going to do this just so it's easier to copy. And we only need six. Uh, six. Yep. And then we can just pretty much copy this part. Just paste it right here. I should dye them all blue. And then, honestly, the same, like, if I just do this... Paste it here again. Yeah, wait, hold on. If I copy this and paste it up top here, that puts. Oh, we're going to need to do a little bear squiggle. Look at that. It's been a while since we did one of those. Just have. Looks right. Cool. And we're right there next to the hub. Not that far at all. I can bring it up along the side of the other thing there. So if I do a little... Nope, not that. If I do one of those, 
bring this back in. Oop, wrong button. Uh, there. Oh, whoops. up again. I don't think I'm ever going to get used to that. Perfect. And a little speed speedometer thing should show us that we're getting the maximum amount that our conveyor belts let us do. I think. Let's see, wait here, see if anything messes up or not, but I'm thinking it's probably not. Yeah, it's a little overkill, actually. Turns out. <laughs> but hey, I'm okay with that. That just means when we start upgrading stuff, we don't have to worry about like improving this again. Yeah, it looks pretty good. And we're, we're, we're all on time. Like, this is quitting time. So all it's have to do is kind of just let this run for a little bit. Like we have been. You know, once again, par for the course. Part of me wants to duplicate this, but also I don't. So maybe I won't do that. Or... We could, in a sense, kind of like uncap this just a little bit. So that's six. What if we take this up and over? Does it lose a little bit there? It does. But I think if they were separate, then that would still work, right? So, yeah, what if we did... And I'll have this one come up in here and this one go. And we'll just have it follow. We'll kind of double it. That way it won't take so long. So instead of 16... Or 16 point whatever per second, we'll be getting... Uh, I don't know, like maybe 10, but twice, as soon as it catches up. No way, it's only 18. Oh, well, that's lame. It's just the tiniest... No, we did really just split it in half, didn't we? Alright, so it turns out... I, I guess it's not 12. It's probably 10, like we were saying. 12 is just like a nice even number. So we didn't really do anything. We didn't make it faster at all. Well, that's fine, I guess. Yeah, it's whatever. Alright, well, I'm going to clock out, and I'm going to let this run for a bit, and then we'll see what happens. Well, I'm not clocking out, but, you know, we'll see what happens anyway. Well, I'll be. I thought there was going to be maybe a little bit more, but reading this little description, I think... I think it's it. that's it. It said the shapes are all random now, so we just need to like create a machine that can do it all like at any point. Just quite interesting. It seems like it might take a lot of work, but 
it outputs the the shape of the thing. So if we make a big machine that reads it, it can put it all together for us. I don't know if I really need to do that or not. Um, hmm. For now, I guess I'll clock out and I'll head home and we'll think about how I want to pursue this. Maybe I'll get like an email or something about different tests or something. But either way, I'm out.